Hello and welcome to the Ice Yards. I'm doing an uh, sort of an unpopular game. It's called um, Ship Sinking Simulator or Sinking Simulator. I'm just playing it, so I have no idea. It's really fun though. Um, so this is what your ship looks like, and it currently has no sounds. And there's a there's a couple menus up here. For some reason, it doesn't record them. So, like, let's see here. So you can, if you do drag, you can drag the ship around. And basically, this game is about sinking ships. And you can make your own ships, too. I will make a video on how to make your own ships. It's a little bit hard until you know how to do it, and then it's super easy. <clears throat> so, there's that. So, see, I dragged it a little bit, so it's moving. So, if I do... If I do smash, and kind of break little pieces off... Um, I'll show you how to sink it in just one sec. I don't know if this is recording, but over here, there's a... Um, this is a menu. You can't see it in the recording, unfortunately. But right now, there's like a ship depth. And so, this is how deep it is. But I can make it. One sec. Oh, crap. So, this one. Alright. So, I can make it super deep. Or not at all. I'll just do it right there because it takes a while for it to sink. Kind of. Uh, I can make it. Like the, I can change the buoyancy, the strength of it, so I can make it instantly fall apart. I can change the uh, wave height. It goes from zero to ten, so this is zero, completely still. This is ten. Ten is like hurricane height. Like, it is so. Oh, I just yeah. See, <laughs> I I ugh. I can't even talk. Holy crap! I can't even. There we go. Yeah, I can't even talk. There we go. So yeah, if you drag it around, so this is like a hurricane height, height uh, waves. You can see right there that shows the water. So since there's holes in it, it's gonna start filling up with water. But if I, so if I break a little hole, and you can change ships too. He even has the Titanic. The person who made this. Um, so yeah, see you'll see um, the water starts coming in and you can see where it's like being stressed like the I can't even oh my gosh it's so I'm so tired so sorry if I suck at talking uh, also happy birthday Kevin um, and if you guys are new to the channel since this is a first episode or no this is a uh, yeah I am I start Sam sorry I suck at talking and yeah so there's that so yeah, it slowly sinks, unless you, like, so if you zoom in, you can see how it's made, kind of, yeah. Then if you zoom out, this is what it looks like. It goes on forever. I don't think anybody has ever found the end. Uh, so yeah, see, it's slowly filling up, but you can make that faster by doing that. So, I mean, it's pretty realistic when it sinks, although a real ship takes hours, sometimes days to sink, but who has that time? So it's very fast, which is good. So yeah, you can even break it while it's underwater too. You can split it in half. They break. Uh, yeah. So and then if I grab this, ah, oh, never mind. Yeah. So when it hits the bottom, it should smash into the bottom. Let me hurry and make this less buoyant so it sinks faster. Less water pressure. Strength. I'll put that down to five. There we go. That way it'll, f like, fall apart when it, uh, hits the bottom. So, see, that's why you, I kind of want it, like, um, not as deep, because it, it takes a while to sink sometimes. Unless it's, like, super heavy. Uh, right now there's only a couple materials. He's thinking of adding gold, I believe. Um, so, yeah, you can kind of drag that around. I don't know. And you can cut it. And then it's about to hit the bottom. Actually, I'll put the strength up a little bit. So yeah, it hits the bottom, and it's on the bottom. Also, if you want your ship... Uh, let me see. Let, hold on. Okay, so these ships can fly. Now, when I say they can fly, I don't mean like flying around like an airplane I mean this watch this so if you put the 
So if you put it down a little bit, and then you put the ocean depth way up, it shoots it into the air. What the heck? This usually doesn't happen. It usually sinks shots way up. But, um, yeah, so there's that. Um, I'm going to load up a new ship, because this one got obliterated. And I need... Yeah, so I had to stop the recording and then restart it, because um, it tends to crash whenever you try to switch the ship. So, I will see you in a minute. Hello. Alright, so I got this. This is one of my favorite ships that comes with the game. Oh, by the way, this game is free. I forgot to mention that. Uh, so, I will put the link in the description to download it. Uh, so yeah, just moving along. This is actually very sturdy, and do you see these little things in the middle? So like, um, let me hurry and turn the wave down to zero. What the heck? There we go. All right, didn't work for a second. So if you break this, so the yeah, so it starts filling up with water. The black stuff is the outside. The white stuff is uh, just walls. So the black stuff is like waterproof. So see, it doesn't go over until it goes over these, over the brown peats pieces. Peats. What the heck? Yeah, I'm super tired. <laughs> I've been tired for days. Okay, so yeah, see, it starts flowing over a little bit. Uh, but then, let's see that. So yeah, there's that ship. Uh, yeah, so you can see it starts sinking. Actually, hold on, let me put, if I put the strength all the way to zero, it just shatters. The whole thing just falls apart. So there's that. <laughs> it's sinking. I love this game. Yeah, so if it's on zero, it just shatters and explodes and falls apart. Uh, so yeah, I'll put the strength back up. So there's that, and I'll make that a little bit like that. First, slingshot it up. Oh, yeah, you can zoom in and then move around with uh, right click. So, this is so weird. This never happens. Oh, wait, is it up? Yeah, there it is. All right, see, it goes up super high. Holy crap. Yeah, so the depth can go down to a thousand, which is pretty deep. Let me put it all the way down. Yeah, so just dragging up. So this is about how big um a piece of the ship is, so then if you keep zooming down. Yeah, if you see me doing this it's cause you have to right click and then pull it and then keep doing that, you know. Oh, I'll just zoom out. Yeah, there we go. So it's super deep. Might not look like it from there, but Compared to that, it is. Whoa, what the? That's awesome. Is it falling yet? Yeah, this takes a long time to fall. Like, even though it's, like, slowing down, that'll still be that same speed for a while. Uh, so, yeah. Let me go get the Titanic. All right, this is the Titanic. Uh, looks actually really nice. I love it. Like, oh my gosh, I can't even talk. <laughs> okay, so, these are kind of flimsy. Um... Also, there's rope, so if you get these and you just put one line instead of two, it makes rope. Uh, the guy who made this is a genius. This looks amazing. Yeah, so the more you zoom in on ships, they, yeah, you can see the separation, but yeah. I like to zoom it out so you can, it looks like a solid. Uh, yeah, so if I put, I'll put the wave height up to 10, this will obliterate this thing. So then if I try to put it through, if I try to drag it through. Um, also, he's the person who made this is thinking about adding um, people on this, like a crew and uh, motors on ships. Oh, yeah, see that? Look how flimsy these are. The ships are so flimsy. So, yeah, those will dangle around. That has so much stress on it right now. So soon, yep, okay. I was just about to say soon those will snap, but apparently they already, they already did. Holy crap, can't talk. Uh, it's so long that you can see that whenever it goes, it like bends, and then those get like close to snapping. So yeah, that just fell off. And it will completely go off for soon. Um, also, so it has these in it too, and 
inside the ship too. So that means if I break, if I break, yeah, I'll just have that so it's a little bit weak. So soon that's gonna break. I'll just make it like that. Uh, yeah. So those are falling. Those are uh, connection pieces because I don't. Yeah. Like if you look, these are all connected by little dots. You can't really see them right now, but like if I were to smash some of that. What the heck? It's not smashing. There we go. All right. So yeah. Also, there's a glitch where sometimes those just become non-existent and they just stay there. So, a couple glitches. I'll just cut that off so it looks nice. Uh, yeah, as you can see, the Titanic is now splitting. Um, yeah. This is a bad day for these people. So that's lifting up because all the air goes up into here and lifts that up while the water's pulling that down. If you don't know ship physics. So, that's coming up. So it's kind of like the real thing, although that would be all the way underwater by now. That's still sinking. Uh, how deep is this? That's pretty deep. Yeah. Uh, and it doesn't collide, so that will be a little bit behind, and that will be in front. So that's nice. That way ships don't, like, smash together. You can also have, if you're building a ship, you can put two down, and there will be two ships. Actually, you can put... You can draw anything and it should float. Unless there's holes in it. So yeah, as you can see, there's a lot. It's taking a while. It's slowly going beneath the surface. So that still has air in it. So let me just destroy a little bit. Air pocket. Destroy that too. And now it'll sink faster. Um, so that's going down. Let's see. Yeah, so there's that glitch one. This looks so cool. And it's like ripped apart. Because these are made by lines, so, you know. Yeah, there's the dots that you can see. So sometimes they don't have dots, and then they stay there and they don't exist anymore. And they don't sink, so, yeah. You can't touch them, or move them, or do anything. Or even erase them. I'm trying to erase it right now. So, a couple bugs. That's okay. So as this is falling, you can... Sinking, I mean. You can actually cut it up a little bit make it break even more you can cut off these you can destroy the ship completely if you wanted to although it would take a long time because the ship is pretty big so <laughs> that's still falling there's a couple dots down here just erase those uh, let's see you can pause the game and you can unpause it although be careful because sometimes when you pause it for a long time oh there's another glitch if you pause it for a long time, it sometimes, and just sometimes, when you unpause it, everything explodes and shoots up in the air like I showed you guys a little bit ago at the first of the episode. So yeah, that's still good actually, that's fine, but it'll now snap because the front's kind of breaking, and that's coming down, <laughs> and then that's where I cut it, so it ripped. So yeah, the Titanic is sunk, and they will stay there forever unless you, like, it's fun to have them kind of like on weird angles, and then just put the strength all the way down to zero and watch them crumble. Look at that. There's another glitch. There, got rid of that. Okay, yeah, that had a dot, so I was able to delete that. There's the back part. Yeah, you can kind of tell what things are. This one's stuck on something, so... Oh, uh, yeah, there's a bunch of glitches now. That just collapsed. I'll cut that piece off. And there we go. Yeah, sometimes it glitches and then it holds the ship up. So there's a bunch of glitches there. Um, yeah, as you can see right there, it's holding that up. So if I cut that. There we go. Yeah, that usually doesn't happen, but sometimes it does. Okay, so there's that. There's so many ships that he has loaded up. Um, I guess I'll show you some of mine. All right, so this is um, this is one of my ship collections. I say uh, ship collections because there's a bunch of them. These used to be lifeboats, but now they're falling. I just cut a hole accidentally. 
Uh, yeah, so those are lifeboats. They tipped over because they do that. Fishing boat, a uh, cargo ship, and a cruise ship. So this is an this is a example of a bunch of ships being on the same one. So you just draw more ships, and since they're not connected, they just float apart. Uh, that's filling up with water because there's a hole that I accidentally put in the top, and it's sunk. There we go. Yeah, so these will move and stuff. Um, I put that there, so like, get rid of that shit. If you smash this part right here, and this will start to flood, but if you can fix it in time, like, yeah, so that will block all the water, so wa the water won't be able to get in there unless it pulls the whole thing down or rips it. So if I hurry and cut this, then it should be able to save the ship right there. Yeah, so see, that'll sink, but that'll be fine. Oh, I accidentally cut a hole in that ship, too. I'll just cut a hole in that lifeboat, too. So that ship is sinking. We got half of a ship, and the other half is sinking. We got a, a fishing boat. That thing has never sunk, but unless I, like, snip a piece out of it, which I'll do now. There's a fishing pole. And so if you snip at the top, if you break at the top, uh, one sec, that's sinking. One moment, let me hurry and make this a little bit. Uh, uh, there we go. Yeah, something just sink shot it up. So, whoops, I pressed the wrong button. All right, and there. So, uh, yeah, so there's that. One lifeboat left, which that has a hole in it. That should be sinking right now. Here, I'll break that in half. There we go. Yeah, see, it's kind of like, it's a little bit glitchy. I'll just destroy it. So, yeah. Break that. Break this. So, if I, yeah, I built cranes, too. So, like, you can cut off the whole bottom. Which, uh, ships don't, don't float without a bottom. <laughs> now you know. It's, it's weird. Yeah. You, everyone knows that. Um, so... If I put the waves up super high, see it's kind of gets over it. So if I drag it around, it should be able to sail around unless it flips a lot. Just saying. And you can see that's kind of breaking. Yeah, the more s the bigger the ship, the harder it is to pull around, and it is more laggy. There's the front of the ship, and there's that other one. There's the bottom of the ship, so that's coming. Back, I mean. Yeah, so see, water flew up over this and got in it, and now there's water in that. So if I just rip the back off, like that, that side will sink, and that side will sink. You kind of get it. <laughs> it's so awesome. I love this game. They need to add sounds, though, because there's no sounds. don't know if I mentioned that already. Yeah, so there's some glitches there. It doesn't usually have these glitches, but I don't know. I guess I'm just having a bad day. Unlucky. So that's sunk. That's somehow still floating. Let's make that not happen anymore. There we go. So see, you got rid of the bottom. It sinks. So now there's a... Uh, I'll show you the biggest ship I have ever made. All right, this is the SS Almost Good. I don't know why I named it that. That's it's gigantic compared to other ships. These lifeboats are about as big as the I think the first ship I showed you, so they're pretty big. That's how they're supposed to float. I brought the cargo ship idea over here again. So yeah, see how it's kind of they're pretty big, so they fly up a little bit. Um, I have the buoyancy up pretty high, so they sink. I mean, sink. They float pretty well. Um, so yeah, you don't even need a ship that works. You just need the, the outside of it, the inside, and then put the buoyancy way up. I have the this idea. So if it it takes a while for it to sink, I don't know why I put a random room on the back. Got two giant, uh, whatever they're called. I forget. Got another cargo ship, except without all the cranes and cargo, and two lifeboats. So, if I put the wave height up again, and you can change the wave height 
wave height too. Like if you put it to five, it's not as high. Two, it kind of just rocks it a little bit. One is like barely there, and zero is not there. So I'll put it up on ten. That's already breaking a little bit. So see, it takes a while to move it. Like I'm pulling it. Uh, yeah. So that one's getting pushed backwards. This is getting pulled. So if I sink, let me sink um, a lifeboat. Pull that all off. I'll sink those lifeboats. That's about to break, so <laughs> might as well help it. <laughs> so there's that. Yeah. So anything will pretty much float. These are I just started yesterday making these, so they look kind of bad. But you know, what can you do? So let me yeah I'll just put a little hole and see how long it takes to sink this while I pull this yeah hopefully I can get it going yeah that's starting to fall apart holy crap that's actually falling apart pretty fast holy crap yeah so you can see it just ripped all this you can kind of see the outline of the ship that's going behind it. Uh, that's starting to sink, but that's in the way, so that's good. These are taking a really long time to sink. Yes, yeah, so this is just passing by. Um, I will rip this one even more. I will make a bigger hole. I'll get rid of the whole bottom of this. Hopefully this doesn't crush my game. Yeah, whenever uh, you're recording with fraps, this game tends to crash a lot. But without fraps, it works actually really well. So yeah, you can see the tension on that. That's about to rip in half completely. That's still sinking. That's what is that doing? Oh, that's stuck. Dang. Oh, as you can see, that just rips in half. Yeah, so they break on their own sometimes. Yeah, and that's flying up. And that's going down. That actually sunk pretty fast. Usually it takes a long time. Yeah, that boat is ruined. I don't know what the heck. It's just stuck there. So that will sink. Um, let me put the... I'll just put this... Put the bottom up pretty high. Just so we don't have to wait. Oh yeah, if you put it all the way there. <laughs> with this ship. It's like hanging out. So let me uh, make that a little bit deeper. All right. Um, I will just cut this up a little bit. Just make some little holes. Make some holes in this ship too, because it seems to be taking a while. So this ship is gigantic. So, yeah, look at that. It's big. People have made bigger. I've seen people make aircraft carriers on this. There's different materials that make different colors, so you can actually make it look like an actual aircraft carrier. So I thought that was cool. Um, you can build anything. I saw a guy do a troll face, and it fl it was floating. So I guess that was cool. Uh, let me make that a little bit sinking faster. Usually I don't have to do this, like make it sink faster, but I'm recording, so I don't want this video to be super long. Uh, there's that. Yeah, so I can actually rip this off. You see that the water. Yeah, so it turns blue when it's full of water. I don't know if I said that, and if you haven't figured that out by now, maybe this is not the game for you. <laughs> maybe you shouldn't be even playing video games, but okay. So there's that. Uh, I will make this super. I'll put the strength all the way to zero, and we'll watch it crumble. Actually, wait. I'll put it up to ten, and then when it hits the bottom and stays on the bottom, then I'll put it to zero, and it will just crumble down. That's a good plan. Where's the other lifeboat? Oh. It's like right... It was right there. You can see that piece flew off there, and now it's hanging. I think that was where it was. I'm not really watching. Oh, that's where the lifeboat was. You'll see that that's crumpling down. That ship is still sinking. <laughs> There's the front of that. It's like strung up. <laughs> yeah, sometimes when that happens, it holds pieces on like that. 
That's pretty rare, though. Even though it's been happening the whole time I've been playing this, but today. But that's fine. Yeah, this whole piece is gone. Holy crap. So now that this is on the ground, the bottom mostly, it's kind of holding that up. So if I make the strength, if I just do that a couple times, actually I'll just leave it on zero. It should start to crumble. You don't have to make it crumple, but it's pretty fun to do that. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to try to make a video on how to make your own ship. Look at that. Yeah, so see, it's being held on by these. And I take that off and start to fall. So those are crumpling, and yeah. So there's that. Um, yeah, so this usually doesn't happen, but I think it's because Fraps is messing with it, which that happens a lot to me. So yeah, that crumpled. So yeah, that was uh, Sinking Simulator. Holy crap, look how high that went. Where is it? Yeah, so look, if you zoom out, you can't even see the ocean, and it's that high. So, And it looks like a blob because it's showing you where your stuff is, so it kind of like makes it, you know what I mean. So the more you zoom in, the less buff it is, I guess. Buff? I don't even know. I'm so tired. Uh, yeah, so that was Sinking Simulator. Um... Go watch I Started United because we're that's our uh that's what we're trying to get popular right now. That's what we're working on. Um go watch my friend uh Kevin's channel. It's uh Ruby Crafter. I'll put that in uh the description too. Uh it's his birthday, so remember to tell him happy birthday and I will see you in the next video of whatever I do. It's probably something stupid. Goodbye. My ship is sinking. I need help. Someone send help. Happy birthday, little. Oh, crap.